Hey everybody, so glad that you came to check out the channel. Uh, this is Scaretober. It's descended upon Taz and Philly, so I apologize in advance because I don't know what might infiltrate this reaction video. Um, we've had all types of ghosts and ghouls and, and uh, everywhere, and I never know when they might pop out. So you've been warned. This is a reaction video, though, because we have to still give you what you want, reactions. This is a special one because it's due to a PayPal donation request. So this is, I laughed. I got to admit, I laughed when I saw the name. I was like, what? Who? So I never heard of him in my life, which is great because I would like to be surprised um, on the channel. So this is a request by a group named Snarky Puppy. Yes, I said it right. Never heard it before in my life. The song requested is called Lingus. And this was the link that I was given, just so you know. I wanted to know a little something about them, so I just looked it up on Google. It says, Snarky Puppy is an American jazz fusion band led by bassist Michael League. Founded in 2004, Snarky Puppy combines a variety of jazz idioms, rock, world music, and funk, and has won five Grammy Awards. So that's pretty awesome. That means that they've been out there for a minute. And I never heard of them, but that's okay because there's so much music out there in the world. Can anybody ever say that they've heard all the music in the world? I think not. So I've never heard of them before. This is going to be my first time, and I haven't pre-watched it because who wants to do that? So um, my reaction is going to be real and authentic, like our thumbnails say. Uh, make sure that you support these musicians. That's what we represent on this channel is, is to have that appreciation of music. So if you can purchase any music that they have out there, great. If not, you can do the gift of free. Subscribe, like, and comment to their song. I have the links all in the descriptions, okay? Please take care of the musicians first. Take care of a second. All right, subscribe to us and smash those notifications as well, please. And any donations is appreciated because it goes back into the channel. With that being said, I will shut the hell up. Let's hear what this song is all about, and I will commentate more afterwards. So here we go.
claps and applause. And if I was standing, I would take a bow to them for musicianship. Like that was just exuding musicianship, like instrumentals, instrumentalists jamming out, sounding great, doing their best. Um, I'm a little bit jelly because I can't play one damn instrument. Um, Oh, I lied. I can play a little bit of piano, just a little bit, but not not enough to be in that band. Like that group, like they would have laughed me out because they were they were committed. And, uh, I was feeling for the guy on the drums because I personally am a sweater. Um, I think they call it hyperhidrosis. Like I sweat a lot, so um, he was sweating his ass off on them drums, but he was smiling. He was smiling. See, I wouldn't be smiling. I don't like sweating, so. Uh, but he was committed. I was thinking about him. I was like, I feel you, man. <laughs> um, well, I don't often hear complete instrumentals. I like them, um, you know, but they're few and far between. So um, I think this is called, because I just had a conversation with one of our fantastics in the comments not too long ago. And then we I did a song which dominoed another song that I reacted to. And he educated me. I think this is what you call absolute music. Like it's music that's not about a particular subject or, or person or anything like that regard. It's just the beauty of music. And like comparison to, um, what is it, Beethoven's uh, symphony. Uh, you know, it's, it's, it's all instrumentals and it's not about something specifically. So I think that's what I'm trying. I can't remember everything. I, I read a lot of comments and stuff, but that was kind of new, recent rather. So I think that's what you call absolute because I don't know what the hell a lingus is. Um, let me know in the comments. I know I could look it up, but I don't want to. That's intentional because that's a conversation that I can now have with you. We do like to learn from you in the comments, just like I mentioned the absolute. Um. So let us know what Lingus is. But this is one of those things like the instrumentals can't tell you what Lingus is or meaning. Or I don't know how they even came up with that name. But uh, so, yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, they were really committed. And it sounded really grew. Like, I'm not I'm not a musician. So, like, the way that they change. And I, so I might be wrong on the words, too. But the way that they change tempos and stuff like that and all that stuff, like, that's something that you have to have a really good refined ear to like for me, when it changed certain pitches or tunes, I was like, I was like, wow, that's, that's different. Um, so I wouldn't even, I wouldn't even know basically if somebody was off key, that's just because I'm not like musically inclined like that when it comes to instruments, I'm more lyrical, but, um, they did just such an amazing job. And you know what else was interesting? Cause I'm a visual person. Plus, I'm a freelance web designer, so I'm always looking at things. This is the first time I can recall that I've seen every last person in the damn video had on headphones. Like, the headphone company that they bought those from must love them. They must have said, yeah, we need to order 100 headphones. And the first time I saw that was actually recently on this TV series that I watched called Below Deck Mediterranean. And they had a party on the yacht. But everybody had on headphones. And I'm like, I was like, that's weird. But then I was like, but then that's interesting. Cause I'm like, maybe they have those type of things normally. Like if you're in an apartment, let's say you're in an apartment building and you want to have a party, you obviously can't be jamming with the volume high. So do people all come with headphones on and like have a quiet music party? I don't know. So that's the first time I saw it. And then now on here, but this wasn't an apartment. So it was interesting. Everybody had on headphones. So they really, I guess, were magnified audibly by the, the music. So that was interesting. Let us know. Let us know in the comments if you can a little bit more about that. Like it was just interesting that everybody had headphones on. Like, um, so yeah, I never seen that before recently. Um all right, so I'm showing my cards. I don't know what else much to say because, again, I don't listen to instrumentals much, but I love the musicality of it all, and I love how they all had their parts. And I loved how 
it when it it would they, everybody was jamming out and then all of a sudden it dialed down the crescendo lowered until it was just that one guy on the synthesizer i guess that would be and he was doing dual ones which was awesome but then all of a sudden it crept back up like a roller coaster you know it started on inclining back up the hill so i like that um the highs and lows of it all but uh yeah, this comes to the part of our show. We always do our thumbs up, pass if we like a song, thumbs down, ass if we don't like a song. I actually liked it. I did like it. So that's cool. The beauty of music, the beauty of this channel, because, again, if it wasn't for this channel, I don't even know if I would have ever heard of, of this group before. So a lot of new music, well, new to us, has been introduced to the channel, and um, that's really cool. So hopefully this channel will help them gain more exposure and notoriety and it will help other people hear them for the first time like myself so thanks so um thanks so much for tuning in i hope that you survived uh again through this whole month of scare tober it's just getting underway so i want you all to take it easy and keep it breezy <laughs>